I'm at Culver's in April and there's snow flurries starting. I don't know why. It was 81 degrees two days ago and now we're back down to 39. So anyway, there's some new sandwich at Culver's and I forgot the name of it. Pretzel so let's, something What's it called? It's like a pretzel something. No, it's like a, a no, pub it's, burger or something. No, it's like a pretzel something or other. Do they, you think they still have it? Yeah, they do. I just looked. Oh, you just looked. Yeah. You peeked. You cheated. All right, so we're going in right now. What are we doing? Oh, there it is. Pretzel Haas Pub Burger. We both are right. I'm gonna do a Pretzel Haas Pub Burger with everything on it. Yeah, the combo. Uh, cheese curds, yeah. And a, and a drink. Okay, so here's what's cool about Culver's. You can just grab and go. They have containers already made with different flavors. Like custard. They're famous for their custard. So they have tons, crazy for cookie dough. Oh, they got a Kit Kat swirl. That's pretty cool. The other thing is, the best root beer. The, the best guy root beer at least. But the root beer is so good here. They make their own root beer. And it's cold root root beer. Better than Mug, better than a better than all of them. It's so cool. It's so delicious. Give it some. And then be able to... I'm telling you, this place has so many things going on. On the table, oh, we're number seven. Just wanted you to know we're number seven. There. And on the table, they're even promoting lemon ice. Now, I'd get one, but it's 39 degrees outside. I'm gonna wait for 81 to come back. When 81 degrees comes back, we'll review their custard, That's and we'll review the lemon ices and everything else. Okay, not that it matters, and not that I'm knocking this place, but they just brought our food, it was completely wrong. It was the pretzel burger with no, no cheese sauce on it and onion rings. So let's see what comes out in round two. Okay. Just let it go. Just let it go? Oh, I know, but don't they have the order? Did she put the order in? Do you have the receipt? No, she didn't give me the receipt. All right, things are still good. <laughs> you guys heard me order, and somehow she heard onion rings. She just came over here to discuss with us how we ordered onion rings. Yeah, the combo. Cheese curds. Uh, cheese curds. Cheese curds, yeah. And a, and a drink. And we did not order onion rings. We ordered cheese curds, as you guys heard on the video. But she came over here anyways. And then I said, there's no cheese sauce on the burger. The picture shows cheese sauce. She says, oh, well, we just put like a little bit on top. I'm like, so <laughs> this goes downhill quickly. Let's see what's going on. Culver's, what's going on, man? Why am I having to argue with your employees? All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's get started. We finally got it. Did we get everything right? Yes. <laughs> All right, cool. My wife is so patient today. I wasn't. She's more patient. All right, well, let's go ahead and uh, just try whatever you, what are you gonna try first? Sandwich? Well, you wanna look at the burger? Yeah, sure, let's look at the burger. So it's got a lot of cheese sauce. You remember, their sauce is thick. Cheese, what's right. Johnson? It's got the bacon. It's got another bun. And Those bacon are in the, oh, there's the bacon. The bacon's in between the two patties. So there's two patties, and cheese, cheese in between, and... cheese sauce on top, and the pretzel bun. The pretzel bun doesn't look thick. It's really it thick. Airy. No, it's pretty thick fillet. Oh, is it? It weigh a lot? Yeah, that might be too much bread for me. No, I mean, it's, my, I think my it's taste. perfect. Oh, wow. Okay. All right, can we give that a bite? Tastes tiny bites. Yeah. All right, you got a flavor for it? Mm hmm. Okay, so we're gonna, I'm just gonna dip one of these really quick. You gonna do yours too? Or no. Yeah, no, I'll, I'll. Okay. Yeah, I'll do a bite in a minute. All right, I'm gonna dip one of my cheese curds in the sauce. Give that a scoop. Oh. Wow, it, it gets the film on top real fast. I'm just gonna leave that right there. Look, it's pretty thick stuff. Look, it's all coated. Oh. Pretty good. I literally just dipped cheese in my cheese. All right, so let's try this really quick. Mmm. Right, here we go. Mmm. 
It's a good onion, huh? Wow, that's strong. Are you at cheese sauce? Lots. Yep. Wow. Are you out of curds? Yep. Was it really deliciousness? They're good. Yeah? I like cheese curds. Mmm. Mm. Sometimes they're yellow, sometimes they're white. Really? Mm hmm. Oh, the, they're mixed? Yeah, look, I'll show you. Where's I didn't yours? notice. Hold on a minute. Oh, I didn't know that. I was in there. At the bottom, sorry. Okay. So that one? White. That's white, okay. Nope, that's a small one. White. White. Oh, mine were white. No. You had yellow? Yellow. Oh, okay. All right, cool. So my question to you is regarding the pretzel bun mm -hmm. burger. Would you order that again? No. It was good, and it was light for a pretzel bun. It's not as heavy as most. But I just don't like pretzel buns. I like more lettuce wraps. We don't eat a lot of bread anymore. So when we have bread, like I would carve out and go home and go to sleep. Which we probably will have this video. Yeah. All right, well, I just finished my sandwich, and... I needed all the cheese curds, but the cheese curds are really good. Um, the sandwich is really good. It, the flavor is great. That red onion was awesome on that burger. It really enhanced the flavor. You can't go wrong at Culver's every time I've been here. It's a clean burger, kind of like a uh, homemade burger, like In-N-Out has a homemade taste to it. Same at Culver's. They're based out of Wisconsin. They're getting all their cheese from Wisconsin. That's what makes them so wonderful. And they're famous for their custard. So once again, you can't go wrong for dessert or for a burger. Um, will I order that again? No, because I don't like pretzel buns. Pretzel buns still are too much bun for me. The airier, the less bun, the better. I just need it to hold everything together. That's why sometimes I'll get a lettuce wrap like a Red Robin or Carl's Jr. Because they're famous for wrapping the burgers in lettuce. And then I can do without all that bread. But great job, Culver's. Um, had a little mishap, but everything's good. Uh, I recommend everybody come here, and uh, the they have a great sourdough melt. I think I'm going to try that next. They have a Reuben, too. They have a Reuben? They have a Reuben. All right, more Culver's videos coming up in the near future. But in the meantime, I'll see you on the next episode. Take care. Bye-bye.